Hi guys, welcome back, it's Jenny here. I am so excited because I get to share with you guys my gender of my baby. And um, <laughs> before I tell you guys, I'm gonna put you in a little bit of suspense because that's what happened to me and it was torture and probably much more tortures for me than it would be for you guys, but I'm still so excited to share with you guys. Um, so if you are following along with the pregnancy portion of our channel, then this video is for you. So this week we had our ultrasound appointment to find out the gender of the baby and to check that everything anatomically was going well and it all is, the baby's healthy and that's always good to hear when you're expecting. Um, we got in there and first of all it seemed like we were in the waiting room forever, it was probably like three minutes but like every person they called back we were like oh my gosh, oh my gosh, like I have never been so nervous, I have two other kids and for some reason I was never this nervous. I think because I have two boys and if I had another boy I was gonna be really nervous <laughs> that I would never have a daughter and anyways so <laughs> without giving too much away um, I was shaking and I was sweating like profusely and it's like the middle of winter it's like freezing and I was just like oh my gosh I have never been so nervous for something and so they finally called us back and our technician I think he was a funny guy and I appreciate his humor now looking back but at the time I was like tell me what I'm having, but he went through every little thing, like, okay, here's the femur, oh, here's the foot, let's go find the other foot, and as much as you love to see those things, because it's like your baby and you don't get to see it that often, it's like, I just want to know, am I having a boy or a girl? So it was just a really long, drawn-out process. He went through everything, and he started thinking it was really funny, and I was like, are you torturing me? And he was like, possibly, I don't know. And then he was like, finally, he was like, okay, well, I found everything I need to find, so now it's time to figure out the gender. I just want you to know I saw at the very beginning what the gender is, but I can't tell you anything until I confirm it. So then I'm like dying, and I was like, oh my gosh, you already know, and you've been keeping me. I think we were in there for like 20 minutes. You've been making me sit here for 20 minutes while you're jabbing me with an ultrasound machine. <laughs> Anyways, so he finally is going to look for the gender. The sweet little baby inside me does not move. Like, it just is such a chill baby. My other babies were like constantly kicking me, everything. And this one is just like, nah. Every once in a while I'll feel a little rotation, like not much. And so anyways, he's like having to like kind of jab my tummy, like come on baby, like move. And the baby would like move and then not move. So he's kind of trying to get the baby to move around. And he's like, I'm just having a hard time really seeing it. The baby's not really showing me. And I was like, well, like how sure are you gonna be? He's like. I'm 99% sure, but I just want to be 100%. And I was like, okay. So I was already nervous, like, what if he just can't see it? What if we don't get to find out today? And I had all this anxiety. Meanwhile, my husband is like face, Facebook video chatting with like his whole family on the other end. And I can hear everyone kind of like being anxious and he's just sitting there. And he knew that I was hoping it would be a girl because I already have boys and I would love to experience having a girl. And so at the very end, he's typing on the computer to type onto the picture, the gender of the baby. And he says, I'm really sorry to tell you, but you guys are having a girl. And he typed it on the screen and I was like freaking out. I was crying. I was like so happy. And I was like, I feel like I owe you something. I feel like this was your choice and you got to decide whether we were having a boy or a girl and I owe you a lot of money or something. And it was just like all these emotions. Um, about this baby were driving me crazy, but I am so excited. So yes, we are having a girl and I could not honestly believe that because I feel like it's too good to be true. Um, she's gonna have two big brothers and a little baby girl and this might be it for us. And so that was perfect because now I'm gonna have my boys and I'm gonna have my one little girl and it's gonna be, it's just, it just seems perfect to me. And I'm so happy. Um, I have not bought anything yet. Um, I'm planning on buying stuff, but I'm just kind of trying to wait and not rush into things. With my past pregnancies, sometimes I get a little zealous and I buy things that I don't end up really needing or even using and I don't like that feeling. I would like to be well prepared, but I'd also still like to be reasonable about the things that I purchase. Um, but I am so excited that it is a girl. I'm like ready to start decorating a nursery and I'm just really excited, but I'm gonna hold off on everything for a little bit. We have a lot of big things happening in our life right now, so we don't even know honestly where we're gonna be living when we have the baby. So <laughs> hopefully we can get that all figured out and squared away within the next few months. Um, today I'm going to be 22 weeks, 
So we still have like a while, but not a whole lot of time. So it's time to start planning for things and figuring out what things we need. The biggest thing is that I'm having a girl and I could not be more excited for that. I described it to someone like, I was like, wow, that just made my day. And I was like, no, like that just made my life. Like this is going to change my life forever. I'm going to have a daughter forever. Nothing can change that. And um, I, <laughs> I'm a little emotional about that because I just, I've always wanted a little girl. Um, my whole life, if you asked me when I was five years old, if you would have asked me what I wanted to do when I grow up, it would be to be a mommy and I want a little girl. And um, I'm just so excited that I finally have that opportunity. And I'm really excited that my boys will be able to be big brothers and they'll have a little sister that they can take care of. And I'm excited to see that relationship because they're so tough and rough with each other. And I just am so excited to see how delicate and tender they're going to be with their sister because I know they will be, um, because I know I know their spirits and their personalities, and I know that's something that, that they are going to be amazing brothers. That is probably the biggest announcement of my pregnancy thus far, probably the biggest one ever until I actually like have the baby. But if you guys would like to see some haul videos of the things that I buy for the baby, please comment below so that I can know whether or not I should make those videos for you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a great day.